shot in the chest but alive today and with his family this morning. A Philadelphia SWAT officer is okay after a bulletproof vest saved his life during a shooting yesterday in Fairhill. Eyewitness News reporter Alicia Reed is live at police headquarters for us this morning with the very latest. Alicia, good morning. Good morning, Jen. That SWAT officer was shot in the chest while serving an arrest warrant for a drug suspect. Thankfully, the bullet did not penetrate his vest. He was transported to Temple University Hospital where he was evaluated and then released. It all went down at a row home on 2nd and Lehigh. That's in the Fairhill section of Philadelphia. The former convict who somehow got his hands on a weapon was wanted on a narcotics warrant. Police say the gun violence task force was approaching the third floor apartment when he opened fire through the wall. The Fraternal Order of Police, Mayor Jim Kenney, and Police Commissioner Outlaw are calling on lawmakers to do more about gun reform. Senator Vincent Hughes tells Eyewitness News background checks are critical for people looking to purchase firearms. He says there's $6 billion in funding here in the state of Pennsylvania that can be put towards gun reform. Congressman Dwight Evans acknowledges there is a need for funding. He's proposed a bill that will add one billion in federal dollars to assist law enforcement in solving cases. This is not a partisan issue. So we need to collectively use all our forces to send a message that this violence is unacceptable. To turn these neighborhoods around to make to make them breathe some life and hope and opportunities in these neighborhoods to support and make sure that everyone in the law enforcement community has the up-to-date technology. Now, while lawmakers are working to get guns off the streets, thankfully that officer is with his family this morning. Meanwhile, that suspect was taken into custody. Reporting live from police headquarters, Alicia Reed, CBS3 Eyewitness News. Alicia, thank you so much.